Today I'm gonna to show you how to make puffy paint. So what you need is just regular school glue, liquid glue, should be white glue, and then you just need some regular old uh, shaving cream. So what you do is you pour in, did you, get that from your, did you, get that from you pour in probably about a tablespoon or so of your paint, and so I've already done that, but I'll just pretend like I did it. Then you put in about the same amount of whipped cream, or of the shaving cream, and then you pour in a color that you'd like to add to the painting that you're gonna do. And you simply use a paintbrush to mix it all up into what will become puffy paste, paint. And the puffy paint is what we're going to use to decorate and to paint our planet. So if you have shaving cream and you have glue at home and you have paint, then you can make this puffy paint and it's a lot of fun to work with. So today what we're going to do is we're going to design our very own planet. Here's how we're going to do it. You'll take a Sharpie and most planets are pretty round. So you're going to do sort of a round shape. It might have a few bumps on it because not all planets are perfectly smooth. So that's kind of my big version. Let's see if I can zoom out just a smidge so that everyone can see. Let's see, that's about as far as I can zoom out. So everyone can see my planet. So I'm going to imagine this planet is kind of rough and bumpy and it's got craters. So the craters are going to be kind of roundish shapes all over my planet. And I think there might be some atmosphere too. So I'm going to do a little bit of atmosphere all the way around my planet. Atmosphere is like the clouds that keep in the heat. And then what we'll do is we're going to put in some clouds and maybe even a storm like Jupiter's. And I'm going to section off my planet into different parts, kind of like that. And so now I've got a rough idea of a planet. And I'm gonna choose three colors to paint my planet. So I've already prepared some red, I've already prepared some green, and I've prepared some blue. So I'm gonna take my, my uh, paintbrush and I'm just gonna mix those colors up. So I'm gonna mix up my blue. That's a nice color. And I'm gonna wash it off so it doesn't get mixed up. And then I'm gonna take that same paintbrush and I'm going to mix up the red, nice rich color. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm going to start painting, painting using my puffy paint and adding some texture. I've decided I want my craters to be red and the more paint the better because then it kind of has this cool texture for your planet, which is pretty fun. And then I'm gonna wash off my paintbrush and then I'm gonna add a different color. I think the storm might need to be, this aspect of the storm or this part of the storm is going to be a little bit green, yeah. And so you can kind of see what I'm doing. You just add on more texture and it will actually dry kind of puffy. You need to let it dry for a couple of hours, but it will actually dry puffy, which is kind of fun. And you can mix some of the colors and you can let some of that Sharpie shine through and you can blend it. Do all sorts of things with your puffy paint, but it's a lot of fun. Hope you enjoy.